Hello everyone. We will continue the topic. In the previous video, we took one parameter for the family. Now what we will do? We will simply provide a value help button or F4 button here. Whenever we will click on to that F4 button, it will show our broad desktop or it will show our my documents. So we will simply select the file in the real world. You saw so many examples like this. Suppose you are uploading some documents. So whenever you will click on to upload button, what it is doing, it will show you your desktop or my documents. You can simply select where your files are. Whenever you will select your file, the path of the file will come into that input field. Same thing is here. We will provide a F4 button or we will provide a value help button because we know F4 is called as value help. And whenever we will click on to that F4 or whenever we will click F4, it will show our desktop and we will select the file from our desktop. Now, how to achieve this? We know this is our selection screen or this is our input screen. Whenever you are performing any action on the screen, selection screen, which event is calling at selection screen. Action can be anything. You are going for enter, it's a action. You are going for F for help, it's also a action. So whenever you are performing any action on the selection screen, which event is calling at selection screen and on the selection screen, we are going for F4 or we are going for value request. So how we can write the logic and how we will write the event logic at selection screen. We know we are going for value request. So how we will write at selection screen on value request for what is your parameter name? P underscore five. Now I will activate and whenever I will show you the output, you can clearly understand. You, you can see previously there was no F4 button. Now we have the F4 button. So whenever I will click on to this F4 button, which event will call? at selection screen on value request event will call. Now, we will write a logic here. Whenever user will click on to F4 button, we want to show our desktop so that user can simply select the file. Now, to achieve this, SAP provided a reusable component or I can say SAP provided a function module. So I will simply, simply call that function module. The name of the function module is F4 underscore file name. What this function module will do, whenever you will select the file, it will return the path of the file. It will simply, simply return the path of the file. And we will see how to call this function module. And you will clearly understand. It will show you the desktop and we will select the file. I will go for pattern. We know we can call the function module through pattern button. And I will pass the name of the function module. I will simply uncomment. And what is your parameter for file name? P underscore file. 
now we will see how it will work i'll check the syntax and activate for the best understanding i will put a breakpoint here so that you can understand i'm running the program whenever i will click on to this button i know add selection screen on value request will call i will simply select simply click on to this button you can see add selection screen on value request event trigger and whatever the logic is the part of this event now it is executing i will simply execute you can see my desktop is there whatever is whatever the desktop i have i will simply go to desktop and what is our file this is our file in which we have the legacy data for the material if i will select this file you can see this is our path full path of the file c drive users my user id on the desktop this is the name of the file so whenever you choose the file it simply returned the path so i will just show you by simply without running without breakpoint now you can see we have the path of the file path of the file. now we have the path of the file whenever user will click on to this execute button we want the data which is available at that particular path now we all know whenever user will click on to this execute button we all know whenever user will click on to the execute button on the selection screen which event is calling start of selection so i will simply simply write the log write the event start of selection so whenever user will click on to the execute button start of selection event will call now what is our next target we want to read the data which is available at this particular path now we received the path of the file we received the full path of the file now we want to read the data available at that particular path now to achieve this sap provided a reusable component again we have a function module what is the name of the function module the name of the function module is gui underscore upload with the help of this function module we will read the data which is in that particular file or which is in that particular path with the help of this function module now what we will do i will simply go to pattern button and i will give the name of the function module gui underscore upload with the help of this function module we will read the legacy data available at that particular path and this part we will continue in the next video thank you